4 is run when the fixed iteration is there and while loop is used when the termination condition is known but do while is used when you want to run the code at least once and then after you want to check for the condition if the condition is true then it will execute again that is what the do while is so let me give the demonstration of the do while demo i'm just writing here do while demo dot java so this is my class that is do while demo now i'm writing here that is system dot out dot print line this is the code for the help so i'm writing here if help one four if help two three four and five two four i want to write this is the help of switch three four i want to write that this is the help of for loop four four i want to write that this is the help of while loop and 5 4 i want to write that this is the help of do while loop now i want to ask to the user that system dot out dot print enter your choice and definitely i want to write here and that is 0 4 exit so here you can write 0 4 exit and here you can draw the line also so it will be look properly so i want to develop a simple program for the help of control statement so i want to take the input from the user so i'm just writing here integer ch is equal to s dot next integer now you can pass your choice into switch case and if the case is 1 then I want to write the code for the if help if the case is 2 then I want to write the code for the switch help if the case is a 3 then I want to write the code for the for loop help so I can write here case 4 case 5 and case 0 so this is case 4 case 5 and case 0 and if it is a default then I just want to print the message that is invalid input and if it is a case 0 then I want to print the simple message and that is thanks bye so this is the simple code so I can write here this particular code inside the do while so you can just write this code inside the do while choice not equal to zero so definitely i need to declare the choice variable outside the do while loop so i can declare here choice is equal to for example minus one so this is the default initialization minus one definitely i will get the input from the user and that will be initialized as a ch if the ch is equal to zero then it will simply break the loop so this is a very simple code now you can simply compile this particular code that is java c do while demo dot java and you can write java do while demo so if it is a one then i want to give the help of if if it is a two then i want to give the help of switch suppose if your input is not in a range then it will says invalid input and if you pass here zero then it says thanks and bye now if user pass one then i want to give the help of if so i can just write here system dot out dot print line and here you can write that is if here we can pass a condition if the condition is true then you can write here true part else you can write that is false part so this will be your false part and here you can write slash n 
you can write slash t you can write slash n slash t even if it is required then you can write here also slash n here also you can write slash n here also you can write slash n here also you can write slash n here you can just write semicolon for the system.out.println even uh, you can write this like this and then you can compile your particular code and you can run this that is java do while demo now if you pass one then it says that this is the if help if condition then true part else false part if it is a switch case you can write for each syntax over here if it is a 4, then you can write the syntax of the 4. Let me write the syntax of the 4 over here in a case 3. So you can write here system.out.println. Now, if it is a 4, then you can write 4. Then you can write here, this is initialization. Then, definitely a condition. Then, increment or decrement. Then curly braces slash n, then it is a body part. Then slash n, then you can write curly braces, right? And after that, also you can write the curly braces. I need to write this break after this system.out.printer, right? So I can write here break. I can save this particular code and you can compile this. This is syntax of for loop. I can write here Java do while demo. So if I press 3, then this is the syntax of for loop. For initialization, condition, increment, decrement, body part, and this is for. Even you can write the example over here also of for loop. You can write the example of the while loop. You can write the example of the do while loop. You can give the example of the if condition also. And if you press here that is 8, then it will say invalid input. If you pass 0, then thanks and bye. So this you can achieve using the do while loop. Do while will execute at least once. So it will execute all this. If the choice is equal to 0, then it will simply terminate the condition. But at least once, the menu will be displayed over here.